I'm here just right outside of Quitman with Terry, and you guys are hosting an Eclipse Fest yes. um, on April 8th. So tell people a little bit about how this idea kind of, um, you know, came together and to, to do a festival like this. Sure thing. Uh, it actually all started uh, about two years ago. Um, Kelly Box, a very good friend of mine who actually op operates uh, Speakeasy Coffee here in Quitman. Uh, I got to know her when I first came to town a couple of years ago. And she was just beginning to operate a small music venue called the Tadler right there in her shop. And she always has wanted to have a sort of a dream to have the Quitman area be a place for celebration of local music, of Texas music, singer songwriters and original in particular. And the other piece that she had always wanted, wanted to do was she had heard about this eclipse coming and she wanted to have a festival for it. So we were bouncing ideas back and forth and kind of came up with the idea, well, let's just make it a music festival. And that's what started the whole thing. And we started moving forward and we've talked with uh, some friends that have played there at Tadler, also with Chase Glover, who's the uh, who's the guy that does the booking. He's also going to be playing. He's a musician as well as a constable and a few and other great things. Um, and started putting everything together, and the result is Northeast, Te Northeast Texas Eclipse Fest, and that's where we're standing right now. Is in the is in the grounds where it'll be. It's a three day festival. It's a three day celebration of music, food, and great people. Yeah, so like you said, we're standing right here and where the festival will be. Mm -hmm. Can you kind of tell people a little bit of kind of the layout, the idea of, you know, where everything's going to be taking place? Well, sure thing. Uh, we're right, we're in, we're just east of Quitman. Uh, if everybody knows the area, it's where the uh, Wood County uh, Cowboy Church is. We're just across 2088 from them. And we're standing in a field and uh, right here next, right here to our, uh, in front of us, uh, around over where the, this big old beautiful pine tree is. That's where the stage and where the musicians will all be playing. And then right here, just coming on around the corner, and right here we'll have food vendors and other type of vendors and all kinds of original stuff. Great, good old Texas comfort food. We'll be right here along this line. Trucks and, and booths lined up along here. All back in this back part part of the pasture here will be parking, so there's plenty of room for folks to come in. And then we're going to have camping available, uh, not only here but also next door uh, to us here at Middle D Ranch. Going to be lots available. Both camp uh, they're going to have some RV camping. We'll have some tent camping here, but in this little area in here, in this copse of pine trees, and then also forested area back over here, we'll all be camping. And then lots of room for everybody to just kind of spread out, get the bring in your your blankets and your camp chairs and whatever and just sit back and listen to music yeah it all seems so awesome out here and like like you said very spacious so mm -hmm. there's there's plenty of space to people to hang out lounge you know of course the camping and everything yeah. like that so it should be awesome if people want to learn a little bit more about um this festival that's coming up uh where should they go okay you can follow us on our website it's netx eclipsefest.com uh, we also have a Facebook page, same name, NETX Eclipse Fest. Or if you want to drop us a line, if you're interested in being a vendor or you want to ask more about more definite, you can always send us an email at NETX Eclipse Fest dot, uh, at gmail.com. Okay, awesome, Terry. Right. Um, you guys can see a little bit more tonight at 10 about this. I'm Avery Niles.